Mayor's now back in session. Good afternoon again, everyone. All right, so I believe we are here on the matter of Shauna Gardner, is that correct? That's correct, Your Honor. Andrew Wagley on behalf of the defendant. I just put in a notice of appearance, Your Honor. All right. Good afternoon, Mr. Wagley. Good afternoon. All right. I do have an advisement that I need to go over with your client before we get started. All right. You are being held on a fugitive warrant because it is alleged by complaint that you have committed a felony in the demanding state. A copy of the complaint outlining the charges should be provided to you. You have the right to require that the demanding state secure a governor's warrant for your return to the demanding state. In the event the demanding state does secure a governor's warrant, the governor of Washington will then issue a formal order authorizing your extradition back to the demanding state. You have the right to seek a writ of habeas corpus challenging the constitutionality of your detention. You also have the right to demand court-appointed counsel at public expense to assist you throughout this process, or you may also retain your own attorney at your own expense. The state of Washington may hold you for up to 90 days. The state may hold you for an initial 30-day period, which may be extended by court order for an additional 60 days. During this hold period, you may be entitled to bail on any non-capital case. No other conditions other than, bail, other than bail and your promise to appear for any future court hearings may be imposed by this court. If this court does not receive a formal, a formal order from the governor of the state of Washington, then it must release you within 90 calendar days from today's hearing. So, Mr. Wigley, what is your client's intention today? Your Honor, at this juncture, we do not anticipate waiving extradition. Uh, we want to look into the habeas corpus procedure, and we would ask the court to set um, a hearing down the line um, so that we may address that. Right. And is Ms. Green handling this for the state? Mr. Mr. Right. Right. Yeah, Mr. 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 We're going to ask the court to set a review hearing on September the 14th. We have been in contact with the prosecuting attorney's office in Duval County, Florida. We anticipate that they will obtain a governor's warrant from the governor of the state of Florida. During that time, uh, we're going to ask the court to hold the defendant without bail. All right. And Mr. Wigley, did you want to be heard on the conditions? Your Honor, um, I believe, based on the charge, that there may not be a right to bail under the Uniform Extradition <coughs> Act. Um, we are not prepared to address bail today. All right, so Ms. Garner, I uh, will indicate that this you're being held without bail. Um, your next appearance will be September 14th at 8.30 a.m. And we'll see you back then. All right, thank you. 